wrong with people nowadays over money over money yeah, bro. and people change over money quick it makes no sense to me bro like money should make or break you bro integrity morals like are you a man of principles do you keep your word bro are you punctual are you a fucking you know what i'm saying are you fair in business like there's so many other things that come with it you know what i'm saying like, it's like I don't know, man. I don't know. I feel like we're fucked up, bro. Nah, like, this like people, world is fucked up. people switch over money quick, bro. And bro, there was a saying with Fat Joe when he was. Uh, I think I sent it to you when he was like, he was explaining. He's like, man, I had fifty boys, bro. I went, I took them all to the Ritz, Ritz Carlton in fucking Puerto Rico mm-hmm. in San Juan, and I was chilling. And I told him, I said, hey, man, like I, I brought everybody together for dinner. I was like, hey, man, I don't got it like that no more. Facts, like. Out of the 50 people here, only five of y'all could come now. Yeah, like I, like he said, like out of all the 50 people, only six of them told me, hey, bro, like, yo, I love you, bro. Like, I'm still going to stick around if you're broke or not. Like, or if you got and money or not. And that's what happens, bro. And that's why it's like, I don't know, bro. You got to start weeding out people early before that shit even comes in. Before mm. the money even comes in, bro, you got to start vetting people out and be like, all right, so you're here for this, you're here for that. So when it comes, you won't be around, period. You know what I'm saying? It's like, Cause it, it it happens, bro. People use you. There's plenty of people out there, bro. They got money and they take care of people that after the dinner's over, bro, they go to the rooms and talk shit about the same person that just paid ten thousand dollars for everybody to have dinner. Yeah. And it's just like, bro, like I'd rather be alone, nigga, yeah. than to have bitch niggas like that around me. I'd rather I only have one person. I'd rather go fucking pick Pedro up and just me and him ride out, nigga, than to have fifty niggas around like, oh bro, like, nah, bro, like at the end of the day, like that that's just how it goes. You got to know what comes with different levels, bro. Like having money doesn't come with only glamour and shit. Like you really start realizing like some people are only here for that. Yeah, and like there's people that would just love you just for the stuff that you do for them. You know what I mean? And it's like that's not how it should be. You know what I mean? Like, it gets deep, bro. That's some that's some crazy shit. Listen, man. Real loyalty is tested in bad times. Yep. Straight like that. Like. Bad times really determines if somebody's loyal, if they have morals, if they have principles. Because it's real easy to be cool with somebody when you're cool with somebody. Yeah. But when you're, when, when you, you know what I'm saying? When you're at, at odds and shit, that's really where you start seeing people show their true colors. That's when you start seeing people run on social medias and like do certain things. And it's like, that's, that's not what you should do in a situation if it's a real friend. You know yeah. what I'm saying? It's like everybody goes through certain things, bro, but there should still always be that like standard of respect. You know what I'm saying?